Do you get sharp pain in your knee that comes and goes? Well, today we're going to talk you through five conditions that can cause sharp pain in your knee and depending on the different type of activity that you're doing and the location of pain. Hi, I'm James, a knee, foot and ankle specialist. And today we're going to talk you through each of the common causes of sharp pain in your knee. So the first condition that we're going to talk about is the most common. It's a condition called patellofemoral joint pain, also known as runner's knee. It fits under the umbrella of a condition called chondromalacia patella and it essentially affects the underside of your kneecap. So patients most often get pain with this with daily activities such as walking, going up and down the stairs, up and down hills or running. We get irritation on the undersurface of the kneecap between the cartilage or the chondral surfaces of the underside of the kneecap and of the thigh bone. As you can see from the diagram, the pain is normally at the front of the knee but slightly towards the inside of the knee also. Typically it's worse with bending activities, so standing on one leg and bending down slightly, up and down the stairs as we mentioned, and it's most aggravated by high force activities such as running or hopping, and that's how it's been coined the name runner's knee. The second most common condition of sharp pain in the knee is a condition called Hoffa's fat pad syndrome. So that involves a fat pad that sits underneath the kneecap just at the front of your knee as you can see in the diagram. It's a bundle of fatty tissue that's innervated by blood vessels and nerves and its function is to act as a cushion between the two bones. However, if it gets irritated, overly compressed, it can swell, become inflamed and painful. Often we see this in patients who are hypermobile, so those who when they stand their knee bends back beyond zero degrees. It can also occur through impact, so if you suddenly start kneeling on your knee a lot more frequently, it causes increased compression on the fat pad, it becomes inflamed and painful. So it differs in the first condition, as in it's usually slightly lower down, there's a little bit of swelling in a U-shape around the front of the knee, it's often tender to press on. And typically it's a little bit sharper of a pain than you might get with a patellofemoral joint pain, which is typically more of a duller ache. The third most common condition that might be causing pain at the front of your knee is a condition called osgood schlatter syndrome. So typically we see this most often in adolescents and it's caused by the bone growing at a greater rate than the tendon can adapt to. Therefore the tendon pulls on the bone and causes irritation of the joint. However, there is a high prevalence of this in adults and typically we see the pain on this bony prevalence of the tibial tuberosity as you can see in the diagram. It's often painful to do impact activities. It can be painful and sensitive to touch and you might notice a bony protrudence or what looks like a little bit of swelling on the front of the shin bone. The fourth most common condition that causes sharp pain on the front of the knee is a condition called patella tendonitis. So this is quite a distinct condition as the pain is usually localized to the inferior pole of the patella. So as you can see in the diagram, just at the bottom tip of the kneecap, where the tendon inserts onto the bone. It's very much a mechanical tendinopathic condition, meaning that it's irritated by impact activities, walking, jumping, and typically when you land and absorb the impact, you get stress placed through that patella tendon and causes increased pain. If you slip your hand down onto the tip of the kneecap, you can usually press on it and that usually irritates your pain. It doesn't give you pain at rest and the pain is typically very localized to that inferior pole of the patella. The fifth most common cause of sharp pain in your knee that can come and go could be a meniscus tear. So as you can see from the diagram, the meniscus is a spongy type of cartilage that sits in the middle of your knee. It helps to work as a shock absorber and facilitate the congruency of the joint. You can get an acute tear of a meniscus from a rotation or sudden twisting action and that means that as you move and as you bend your knee you might catch it on the tear and that can give you a sudden sharp pain or you can develop innocuous degenerative tears over time and these are small little tears within the meniscus and sometimes as you move the knee so typically if you're getting from sitting to standing kneeling to standing or from crouching to standing you can catch on one of these tears and give you a sharp pain and as soon as you move over the tear the pain eases and then you can go on with your day-to-day -day activities so there are five conditions that can cause sharp pain in your knee that can come and go if you've got any questions please leave them in the comment section below if you found the video helpful please like and subscribe to the channel